Thank you, Madam Speaker. I have been so pleased to hear colleagues across the aisle speak in favor of competition and price negotiations, and I hope that they will follow through in their commitment to supporting competition and negotiation uh, and co-sponsor the Lower Drug Costs Now, H.R. 3. But that is not the bill we're talking about today. Today we are talking about Affordable Insulin Now Act, a bill that would make changes in the lives in Virginia of the more than 630,000 Virginians who are living with diabetes. The Affordable Insulin Now Act would finally make sure that every affected child, teenager, family member, every American can afford the insulin that they need. People living with diabetes do not have the choice of whether to purchase insulin or not. They depend on it to stay alive. People like my constituent, Joshua Davis, a 13-year-old Virginian with type 1 diabetes who accompanied Dr. Jill Biden to the State of the Union address earlier this year. I am proud to co-sponsor this legislation to make sure that no American is skipping life-saving doses of their insulin or making choices between whether they take their insulin or put food on the table. I am grateful to my colleagues for leading this effort. Thank you so much, Madam Speaker. I yield back.